this is Kotal for another War Rights event. Hope you all having a good weekend. Uh, this Saturday, we have the second for this weekly's UEC. It is Server 1. Uh, it is a bloody lane map. This is going to be a lot of fun, this one, but it's a very tough one for the attackers. Right now, Server Pop is 160. Uh, we have on the defending side 78 for the CSA and 82 on the attacking US. Let us take a look at who is on the CSA defending team, right, starting we'll with the Artie here, commanded by Captain Kai from the CQB. Looks like they've got one gun. Let us take a look at the rest of the defending CSA infantry side here. They have on their team the CQB. We've also got a combined unit here, headed by two USC, joined by the 83rd PVI and the 4th New Jersey. I might call that the NATO unit. Um, 6 Texas is also joining in. And then the 5th Ohio from the German Corps. And then for leadership here, we've got Colonel Doug leading the CQB. Again, you guys heard him last week uh, doing a great job on commentating, so I really appreciate his help on that. Looking forward to seeing him lead. And we've got Harson leading the 5th uh, Ohio. Good to see him. I think it's been a while since I've seen him lead, so I'm glad to see him back in there. We've got Captain Russo leading the 6 Texas. And Captain Eddie from the Old Guard. I'm sorry, from the Home Guard leading the two USC. It's the home guard, not the old guard. The home guard. They're not old. All right, now taking a look at the attacking USA team here. We've got the rest of German Corps here. Or is this just the rest of it? No, it's just uh, 22 VA from uh, German Corps. I apologize. Then we've got SB, the 51st New York. Let's see here. And then we've got the NYV, both contingents, both the 6th and the 88th here. And who is leading these intrepid men? It is Major Venom leading the 51st. Jack Stone leading the 22nd VA. Parker leading the NYV. Oh, I'm sorry, the 6th New York. And they are joined by Lieutenant Souther from the 88th. And that is everyone. We are live at 40 and we are live. Uh, just a reminder, so if you guys are... Looking for a, an event on Saturdays at 8 p.m. GMT or 3 p.m. Eastern. Uh, the UBC plays every week. Um, it is actually both Fridays and Saturdays at that time. So I left a, uh, we'll leave a link in the description for the event as these units start heading off here. If you're looking for, speaking of, if you're looking for a unit to join, I will also leave in the description links to all of these units discord so if you see a unit that looks like fun go ahead and join up whether you're a veteran or a uh, new player and if you like this you take a look at this in your stream you're wondering where game this is this is war of rights um it's currently available on steam i left a link in the description to the discord and the website it is currently 30 us dollars but goes on sale quite regularly for a much bigger discount so this looks like fun go ahead and pick it up and again for my own personal grip though um, you know, if you like this content, you like to see more, uh, you know, always help, always appreciate any help, you know, and the like, subscribe, and uh, comments. The the they do help grow the channel, and I do appreciate it. But we are, looks like a full send for the Union down this uh, kind of center position here. Right now, the CSA has CQB in the center. They're supported on their left here by 6 Texas. And it looks like the weight, we've got the... Uh, the 5th uh, Ohio over here in the woods, in the woods, in the corn, and then we've got the NATO force here under the home guard defending the far right. But I don't see anybody going far right. It looks like they're all going for the center piece here. And in fact, who is leading the way? It is Major Venom leading the way, charging down the hill like a demon. And who is trying to stop him? Can Doug stop him? Can he do it? He's got the whole Union Army coming at him. And they are going to fire and fall back, but they're going to get caught by Venom. And the Union has come out like bats out of hell. And here comes Jack Stone here, engaging the 6 Texas, putting in some heavy fire into these lads here. Let's see what Russo can do. He's returning fire. And this got started quick. Oh, now we have a blocking force also going out here. Who came out here? Lieutenant Souther came out here to try to block the uh, NATO contingent here. Oh, but they also got another element up here. Who is this? Is this Parker and the Cav? Tip of the spear? It is. 
Oh, but they're going to fall back a little bit here after taking some major fire. We'll see if Southern can hold up the uh, NATO force. And it looks like CQB has been wiped out. Here comes Arson here with the 5th Ohio moving up. We'll see if he can outflank the 88th here and try to get the uh, CSA some security here. Some additional shots coming in. 6 Texas still is holding on, but just barely here. Only a few men left. I'm going to check up on the yard. You can see what they're Oh, wait. Bloody hell. Oh, that's still way high. Okay. So there's a rumor here that I suck at capturing Hardy. And I can uh, safely report that it is true. I am horrible at catching Hardy shots. But I shall endeavor to improve my rate. CQB has come back and rejoined here with the uh, NATO contingent. We'll see if this combined element can roll up the flank here, starting out with the 88th. Let's see if Southern can hold them. There's not really much left here, unless the CSA is at spawn, minus a small contingent there from 6 Texas. And Eddie calls charge. He says to go. Only a few men left from the 88th. They have been wiped aside here. Who is the next challenge? Oh, man, it is Parker here and his boys. We'll see if they can stop him and avenge their comrades. Hardy coming in. Slightly off. Oh, but they bypass, and they're going to slam into the side here of the 51st New York. Is 52nd New York in here as well? Did I miss 52nd New York? Oh, son of a bitch, I missed 52nd New York is also in here. I apologize, 52nd New York. Holy shit, I don't know how I missed you guys. How the hell did I miss 52nd? All right, well, they held with a uh, nice little uh, counter charge by the uh, SB, the 51st, and the 52nd New York. Who's commanding the 52nd New York? John Beck, I believe, is commanding the 52nd New York. I'm sorry, John. And, you know, Union has capped early. They came in. Kind of grabbing the bull by the horns here and just going straight for it. And they are a good chunk ahead on morale state. Let's see if the Artie so here, wide. Mr. Kai, can uh, change the so equation. Ahead. Aim at the snake. Aim at the point. Okay, I have one. Uh, yep, 340. Okay, um, it's aimed. All right, prime one's ready. Okay. Too high, too high. Gotta bring it down, take that fuse time down a little bit. Come on, a high three pass, like one. 1740 left on the counter attack, 36 no, no. total. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Can I get a hug? If they come on the right side, I want to hit Oh, yeah. If they come on the left, I want to hit Oh, yeah. Oh, very specific and cab focused commands there from Mr. Parker. He has trained his men to understand these commands. You know, despite whatever's going on in the battlefield, these very specific commands. It did hours of drill time to get that down. Uh, Mr. Southern's heading out to the uh, left side here while we got GC guarding the right and the anchor of the Union here, the 51st and the 52nd, holding down the center. Uh, looks like Rousseau and the uh, Six Texas here. By the way, if I'm fucking up your name, man, let me know. I do apologize. Y ponernos más o menos lo que estábamos haciendo, vale, en en la parte izquierda de la valla. Now what I do like about this right now is Rousseau is not just charging straight in there. He is taking his time and figuring out what he wants to do and waiting for his reinforcements to come in. And it looks like the CSA is gonna mass up on this far side here. CQB going that way. And 5th Ohio moving that direction. Back, but the NATO force with Eddie here joining with Doug. They got one of Doug's boys. So it looks like the entire CSA force has 
cleaned up here on the Union right, CSA okay. left. And the first yep. person that's going to intercept him here is Jack Stone with the 22nd VA. Let's check back on the Artie real quick before the infantry attack begins. Might have to go. Sorry, guys. I think it took a little too long here. Here we got an attack developing here. By the home guard. Uh, still a little bit too high on that already. It's tough because there's no steam chest, so they can't really, uh, you know, um, let them know how these shots are going. Ooh, I'm slamming into that element right there. Nothing to do with the we can see that the uh, Union has collapsed into a very compact line here. The only unit that's not there is 88, but they are quickly moving forward to join this line here. Uh, uh, get some robot voices. Ooh. That was a pretty good shot. Let's see. Okay, here comes Southern. Let's see how he does. He's going to try to get up on the flank here of the NATO force. A couple good shots there from Southern. Nicely done. Good use of uh, the concealment and cover here by Doug. Here comes Harson. He's going to come up and join him. Uh, already high again. Right. Nice volley coming in from CQB. What I really like here, he shoots and he gets back under. You know, the tree is not much cover, but it's something. The bushes aren't a lot of concealment, but it's something. He doesn't just sit out here and reload and wait for the volley. Oh, another rotation out here. Who is this? Six Texas. I like this rotation by them a lot here. Getting a uh, better angle here on the Union. Trying to get them into some interlocking fields of fire here. I missed that already shot. Looks like that element that was on the fence there has been pushed off the uh, NATO element. We'll see what SB is going to target next. So far, they've been able to hold pretty strong here in the center here. It's SB 50 and the uh, 52nd New York here. The New York boys. There's a lot of New York boys here. We got, wait a second, we got 6 New York, we got 88 New York, we got 51st New York, we got 52nd New York. Man, oh man. What's with all these New Yorkers, man? I don't know about this, man. It's too many New Yorkers. I get nervous when I see that many New Yorkers in one spot. I mean, so far, this uh, GC has rotated back a little bit, but they've gotten themselves back reorganized. They're kind of the reserve force now. Um, this Union element here has kind of just stuck in here. And the CSA has not been able to dislodge them. So violence on the object. Ah, son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Okay, that one came in just show. Came in right there. Oh, that would have been devastating on the GC. Right now, this is tough for the CSA. They're going to have to figure out a way to break this here. Only 11 minutes left on this counterattack. Ooh, hearts are getting hit hard here. Hey, 
Taking a lot of fire and losing a lot of men. Let's see here, six Texas. Hey, man. I'm going to be honest here, the CSA is going to do something pretty drastic, I think, here. I don't know if shooting it out is going to work. See if this works for Doug. He's tried to move up in the spot the whole guard was in. But they lost a lot of firepower as well. A well short on that shot. All right, so I like this by Eddie. He's looking for a flank here. Let's see if he's going to shoot from the corner or he's going to try a wide flank around. Now, you could even try to get all the way around and even try to get, you know, on top of this hill if you're feeling really, you know, frisky. It's always risky doing that because you can get cut off here, but, um, you know, at this point, it's, you need to do high-risk cover war maneuvers. Let's see if Eddie can do it here. I believe that he can, Where's the fence? but we will see here. You'll get that the gap after the gap. Let's go. There's always an end to it. They're on the left. Fortunately. Hey. Hey. Going on forever. Bar. Couple good shots That's by Eddie, guys. but I, my, I think he might have shot a little bit too early. Um, oh, the problem was the CQB has already been pushed back, and now Southern's going to move out. Trying to intercept the NATO force. Actually, I think uh, Eddie might be able to win this fight here. Don't clump up too much. We're making a big target here. I'm fine, Mark. Good attack there. Sorry, mate. Stop. Stop. Oh, this is kind of hanging out. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that was close. That was super close. That already shot. I see Jackstone on the 88 has been knocked out. You see how they've gone to turn to deal with that problem. And you can see how the, you know, this is a very mutually supporting, basically, you know, just a, a, a reverse arc, I guess you would say. You know, kind of, it's adjusting based on where the uh, CSA is attacking from. So a very disciplined line here. Seven minutes, 50 seconds remaining on the counterattack, and the CSA is already almost at taking losses. Great discipline here by this union team. It has not been bad news by the CSA. The problem is it's never been strong enough. Oh, I caught that already shot. I didn't miss it this time. Yay! I did it, Parker! Ooh, nice volley there. By the uh, 6 New York here. It looks like Hoss is looking to do a charge here. Oh, I didn't know the 20th was with them. Okay, so it's like two... This is weird. I'm, gonna just, I'm just gonna stick with 5th Ohio and uh, 22nd VA, but there's other elements in here as well from the GC. Good use of cover here by the 6th Texas. You see how long they've been able to maintain this position. Camera, go away. Vale. Oh, we got an attack developing here. Who is this? Oh, here comes the NATO force. Here comes Eddie. Trying to punch into this element here, but they were kind of waiting for him. And they were able to hold. Oh. 
That was a good already shot. Oh, here's a charge coming in now. GC, Harson leading the way. Doug coming in with him. Six Texans coming with him. After that diversion by the NATO force, we will see if this is enough. Can they hold? SB in the fight. NYB in the fight. Here comes Jack Stone charging in with the counterattack. Oh, but wait a second. Eddie, after that distraction, has now decided he is the main effort, and he's going to try to sneak in and wipe out the distracted Union. And he's going to aim for Southern here. But it is not quite enough. And the Union has held. Still some survivors out here from the CSA. Yeah, that's got it. And the NATO force oh, is going to fall back, back a little bit behind the folded gap. <laughs> really nice hold there by the Union. That's what we call a nice hold there. All right, let me check back in on the yard and see how we're doing here, Mr. Kai. Uh, J, do you want me to fire it? Uh, yeah, sh wait, 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 wait. We might need to wait because I don't have binoculars to see. But yeah, just fire it because there's still a in front. Just fire. Okay, uh... I think so. Uh, a little too That's short. Cool. Oh, well, we do have one Union element far out here. It's Southern here trying to disrupt this element. And defeat Harson out here, kind of delay him. Only three minutes 30 left on this counterattack. Here comes Souther. And a nice little disruption attack here. We call, we call, we call. Nice little raid there by Mr. Souther. Of course, we've had this anchor here by the 51st, 52nd, the whole game. Ready for whatever comes. Oh, uh, uh, a little short again. Probably can't see it, but trust me. Straight down that line. By company, A. Straight down that line. Crossing. 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 Oh, you never want to cross the friendlies. That's always dangerous, especially when they're shooting. So looks like they got a couple scouts out here. Who is this? James Joker here is watching the left flank. Volley coming in here from multiple elements here. Oh, Doug is going to try to cross over here, close with the enemy. The NATO force tried, but they took a lot of fire there. They are about wiped out here. And wait a second here. Is this a charge? It is. Venom doesn't want to let them get this breach head. And he is charging in. <laughs> Only a few. Let's see. One minute left. <laughs> And I think this might be it. After the defeat of that charge there. 
From south. That's friendly to our left. Okay, so up and over. They're getting desperate. This is our final push. Shoot them down. Shoot them down. And this is going to be a complete and total victory for the Union. I'm going to just do my final thoughts now because it is over, to be honest with you. Um, Union masked, went in quick, went in fast, went in hard, took the key position, took the key terrain, and held it and kept mutually, you know, supporting the whole time, adjusting to wherever the attack was. Sent some key spawning attacks like this out to disrupt when necessary, but maintained great discipline and delivered an outstanding victory here on this map. So well played to the Union. And uh, CSA had some good ideas, but they're a little bit too spread out. Uh, some decent attacks, but this Union team was just on point and didn't give them any room. So great to see. Uh, looking forward to the next one.